Ooh, here we go. The four horsemen are my most powerful death knights. <laughs> I'm looking forward to this. He sounds keen. The most powerful death knights in Nax Ramas are the pinnacle of Kalthuzad's god. What is with the little card drawing? It's gonna be very interesting. I wanna know how they're gonna mix four horsemen into one hero. How does that even work? Anduin versus the Four Horsemen! We shall grind your bone to dust! The light shall bring victory. Baron Rivendell is immune. Before even looking at the abilities or whatever, I'm assuming I need to kill the other three horsemen before I can take him out. He's only got seven life. Wow. Invader, turn away while you still can. Come, Zeliak. Let us have our fun. Enough prattling. Let them come. Oh, this is great. That's oh, amazing. Just think of what they could potentially do with boss fights. Paladin secret. Do you like to play with fire? That's fine. One, one, one. I mean, I guess I'm just going to throw this at one of them. Ah. <sighs> what? Has three attack if the other horsemen are dead. Oh. Right. I wonder how this works. I wonder how this works. Hmm. That's interesting. Am I going to be able to take control of one of them and make my hero immune? I doubt it. Well, buddy, that seems counterproductive. You are killing your horsemen. Imagine... Double circle of healing. You could just wipe the board entirely. So circle of healing, circle of healing with a soul priest out. And then you could still do two damage if you had a bit more mana. Mm, do I want to just holy nova? I mean, I guess I can. I think so. They're down to three already. Wow. Two, four, six. Okay, so one of them's going down now. That's good. If I use Holy Fire on one, they'll be dead. And... Ooh, should I try? Let me change your mind. <laughs> no ways! No ways! I just did it! Ah. No, that wasn't long lasted. God, that was so fun while it was. Oh, jeez. You know, what a buzzkill. Baron ruined it. Baron. Obey. Baron. I think it could be get down. Of course. Of course, that's what it is. Okay, so you can't have another one of those up, which means I can actually use this here. And then smite over there. Maybe not. Not yet. So I'm going to leave that up for now. Because I want to one-shot him when this one goes down. This is great. The mechanics. How do they think of this? Hmm. 
Okay, wait. So there's gonna be a very specific order here. Thought steel needs to happen first. Oh, avenge! Yes, yes, yes. Then we'll go for this. As then we'll go for this. Hmm. Then I'll heal. Okay, so that's the new paladin secret. I wonder if the class challenges this week include paladin. I do not have enough damage to kill him. And now I do. Right? No, I don't. I still don't. So I could use this and then restore three life on him plus that. Then I'm one off. I could use this. I'm just going to use this. There you go. And I'll restore three life to myself. That's okay. Wow. Sick move, buddy. I mean, he's got so many cards to choose from. And there we are. I don't remember saying that. Nice. So now we get to open the chest. Baron Rivendare. I want to try and use that. Shaman and Warlock. Huh. Okay. Two of the classes that I'm probably worst at. Could be fun though. Could be a whole lot of fun. It's obviously linked to the normal mode wing that we just did. So it's going to be based around the military quarter bosses. I think that could be fun. We're going to do those soon. You can check back here for that. Class challenges, heroic, the lot of it. Obviously going to be a blast. I can't wait. Give it a like, share it, and do all that other good stuff. Let me know if you struggled on the bosses that I just took out. And let me know how much I'm going to suffer on heroic mode. These seem like they're going to be very interesting. Especially... The four horsemen. They're probably going to be super strong or something. I don't even want to think about it. I don't want to think about it. Happy that.